The raise will be a welcome sight for teachers in Bossier Parish because over the weekend, thousands of people rejected a tax proposal that would have paid for teacher pay raises. NBC6's Dominic Dillon joins us now live from the Bossier Instructional Center sharing what's next for many educators in our area. Dominic. Well, Dan, Bossier has a top-ranked school district, but the lowest-paid teachers in the region, and it seems like it may stay that way until a solution is found. Bossier Parish voters overwhelmingly shot down a tax proposal for teacher pay raises and technology upgrades. The Bossier Parish School Board has over 3,000 employees. That is a huge economic engine that you are turning your back on time and time and time again. Saturday, 74% of voters rejected both proposals. Combined, they would have raised property taxes by 24%. We've heard a lot of people say, well, not this, there's another way. Well, it's time to hear what is that way. Bossier Chamber of Commerce President Lisa Johnson says many people think a 24% tax hike is just too much. The large increase at one time and retroactive. And so is this the way to do it? So some of the questions were, are we absolutely sure that there's no money anywhere else? Johnson says it's important the community comes together to find a solution which benefits everyone. There's no easy answer to this. Had there been an easy answer, it would have already been found. And um, so we're, we're looking for a, a collaboration to have a true hard look at the budget. The Bossier Parish School District released a statement saying they're disappointed in the outcome. They have heard the concerns from numerous residents and business leaders and look forward to finding a solution. And teachers have not seen a raise in base salary in more than a decade. Back to you in the studio. All right, Dominic.